Dear chess lovers, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to show you a very good chess game which is played by Gary Kasper. In 1990s, there was one more chess association which is called the Professional Chess Association created by Kasparov. At that time in 1995, Kasparov organized the World Championship. In this World Championship, Kasparov played against Anand. I am showing uh, one game from that uh, World Championship series. In this game, Kasparov played with black pieces, Anand played with white pieces. Anand started with e4, Kasparov replied c5. Knight of 3 which is main move, d6, d4, c takes d4, knight takes d4. After knight of 6, knight c3, here, usually Kasparov will play a6 which is his favorite knight of. But in this game, Kasparov selected g6, a dragon variation. Bishop e3 which is main move. After bishop g7, Anand played coming to d2. In this opening, there is a trap with the knight g4, not now, previous two moves. For example, after g6, bishop e3, if black played a knight to g4, then there is a check. Now obviously, black cannot play knight to c6 because knight c6, pawn c6, bishop c6. For this bishop b5, if bishop d7, then queen g4. For this reason, white will wait for one move to play f3. After bishop g7, usually white will play f3. But in this game, Anand played queen d2, Kasparov, castle king side. He did not play knight g4. But in this game, Kasparov played knight to c6. He did not play knight g4, I don't know why. Then now f3, castle king side. Here bishop c4, bishop d7, h4, h5. Now bishop b3, here Kaspar selected the mode root c8. After knight c6, pawn takes c6. Now Kaspar blocked his own open file. Now bishop h6. Pawn c4. Now Anand played bishop to c4. Otherwise, pawn will go up. Then queen b6. That is on queen b2. Then bishop takes, king takes, pawn b3. For this move, Kasper played bishop b6. Then knight d5. There is a double attack. Then bishop takes. Then pawn takes. After e6, Anand made a mistake which is uh, d takes e6. Here, castle will be equal position. But after e5, Anand took the pawn on e6. Now pawn d5. Here, Anand played bishop e2. Here, if bishop takes pawn, then rook fd8. After pawn c4, f takes e6, white will lose the bishop. So bishop e2 on to c4. Here white replayed with c3. Now rook c to e8. White took the pawn on c4. Rook takes e6. King to f1. After king f1, black played rook f8 to e8. Now obviously black is going to take the bishop, then bishop d3. Now Kasparov took the pawn on c4, again they have to move the bishop. So many times this bishop has moved. After bishop takes c4, after knight e4, Anand resigns the game. Here there is a queen under attack, knight g3 is waiting, if possible queen f2 is also waiting. Rook is ready to come here and here. So many threats. No hope for white. I hope you all enjoy the game. If anybody want to any game to analyze, please text me in the comment. I will post.
please support me with like subscribe and share thank you